Good afternoon, folks. John Nolan here with your PM Update, taking a look at what we're working on for Friday's edition of the Times Leader. It's a festive day here in Wilkes-Barre as the annual Fine Arts Fiesta kicks off, and it's just about back to its pre-pandemic form. Ryan Evans has been out on the square, and we'll have a look at how today's events went. On a much sadder note, Jerry Lynott is following the case of a stabbing that took place this afternoon in the parking lot of Save-A-Lot on South Main Street in Wilkes-Barre. One woman was taken to an area hospital, and a suspect is in custody after police say she crashed the victim's car in Plains Township. Sugarloaf Township, meanwhile, has accepted ownership of a newly repaired Luzerne County-owned road, something county officials have been pushing for. Jennifer Learn Andes explains. In Lifestyles, Mary Therese Beeble talks with members of a local theater group who are putting on a classic Agatha Christie mystery. Remember, too, that Blackout Bingo is underway. You can find your number inside the paper each day. As always, folks, we thank you for reading. If you're not already a subscriber, call 829-5000 or visit timesleader.com backslash subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a good day.